ሰላም ሰላም ጉዴ ይዱ ተከታታዮቻችን እንዲትናችሁልኝ ነው ፍቅር ኪምብርኛው ዛሬ መደሰለመዶ ባበ ደ ቪዲዮ መተናል ዛሬ ማሳያቹ አሳሲን ክሪድ ዘቢስት ሲን በቃ በጣም አዋጊው የሚባሉ ሲኖች ነው ማሳያቹ ወደ ቪዲዮ ኮንቋታችሁ በፊት ፍቅር ኪምብር ሰብስክራይብ ያላረጋችሁ ሰብስክራይብ ያረጋችሁ ይማቻችሁ to finish me off not just yet i want information why are the templars sailing for cyprus it's been a what if i just started screaming people would cover their ears and carry on they've seen an unhappy slave before is off limits show your face nothing under this hood but an ugly old assassin altair alexander you got my message i assumed it was a templar trap who is the woman templar bait she was robert de sab's girl don't belittle me murderer i'm a templar too unfortunately she's a bit of a burden we can hold her for you altair We have a secure safe house. Good. I'm going to have a look around. I'll meet you there.
afraid to leave their homes for fear of breaking some of Greetings, Osman. Thank you. Thank you. 
find the cheats in your boots armor. Strike hard. What have I done wrong? If you see the assassin, I suggest you report him. Maria isn't among the dead, so was she captured or set free? He's fleeing! Don't let him escape! A foul murder has shaken my order. Dear Frederick the Red, slay. He, who served God and the people of Cyprus with honor, is paid tribute with a murderer's blade? Who among you will deliver those responsible to me? Cowards. You leave me no choice but to flush out this killer myself. I hereby grant my men immunity until this investigation is concluded. Bouchard. The citizens are already restless. Perhaps this is not the best idea. If anyone else has objections, I invite you to step forward. Armand Bouchard! Who's that? Ah, an old colleague. Bouchard! An assassin has come to Cyprus. I managed to escape, but he cannot be far behind. Why, Maria, that would make this your second miraculous escape from the assassins, no? Once when De Sharp was the target, and now here on my island. I am not in league with the assassins, Bouchard. Please, listen. De Saab was a weak-willed 
wretch. Verse 70 of the Founding Templar rule expressly forbids consorting with women. For it is through women that the devil weaves his strongest web. Desaab ignored this tenant and paid with his life. How dare you! Touched a nerve, did I? Lock her up! Memory of the... Off me. They consider me a traitor, thanks to you. I am only a convenient excuse for your wrath, Maria. The Templars are your real enemy. I will kill you when I get the chance. If you get the chance. But then you'll never find the Apple of Eden. And what would Curry more favor with the Templars right now? My head or that artifact? I thought so. Despite his bravado, Bouchard obviously took Maria's warning seriously. My sources tell me that after destroying our safe house, he immediately sailed for Karenia. That's a shame. I was hoping to meet him. What's the fastest route there? By boat, definitely. But those pirates won't let you hop aboard one of their ships without good reason. Find a man named Pasha in the ports. Tell him to honor the favor he owes me, and he might be able to get you on the next ship heading north. You're a well-connected man, Alexander. Memory log updated. He needs you to find me safe passage to Kerenia. Ah, <laughs> you must be the resistance cutthroat I've heard stories about. Chasing down Armand Bouchard, are you? Armand and his precious cargo. Cargo? Tell me more. Oh, I've just heard rumors. Holy artifacts of all kinds on these ships. For all I know, he's got the Ark of the Covenant hidden somewhere nearby. En route to the Templar Archive, no doubt. Your guess is as good as mine. As for your transport, meet me on the docks later this afternoon, and I'll see that you get safely aboard. There will be two of us. We won't be late. I'm curious about this Templar cargo. The ship's manifest might contain clues about what the Templars are bringing to their archive. I should have a look now before we set sail, before the ship is crawling with pirates.
Why is he running around like that? This manifest is a mess. A shoddy job done by lazy men. Unless this is a deliberate attempt to hide something. Do that again. I dare you. Where is that damned fool? Where is my first mate? He's gone ashore, Captain. In search of wine and women, eh? <laughs> Listen, we sail for Carinia in two hours. If he's not back in one, he's off this ship. The Templars aren't paying me to play servant to a bunch of drunks. Chased by someone. I found a ship headed for Grenia. We're leaving now. If you expect me to behave while you drag me onto a boat full of pirates, you're mistaken. If the pirates find you, they'll hand you over to the Templars for a handsome reward. Right back into Bouchard's hands. I wish you luck, Altair. Karenia is a rough place these days. But we have many friends in the City Watch. Look for a man named Barnabas in the Commons District. I have not heard from him for some weeks, however, so you may be on your own. Thank you, Alexander. If I return to Limassol, I will report all that I have learned. By then, we will have established ourselves a new safe house. Find us there. I struggle to make sense of the Apple of Eden, its function and purpose. But I can say with certainty that its origins are not divine. No, it is a tool. A machine of exquisite precision. What sort of men were they who brought this marvel into the world? Memory log updated. That's a lovely ring. It was a gift from Robert de Sable when he took me under his wing. This is about all I have left of my ties to the Templars now. Did you study philosophy, Maria? I've read scraps, nothing more. The philosopher Empedocles preached that all life on Earth began simply, in rudimentary forms. Hands without arms, heads without bodies, eyes without faces. He believed that all these early forms combined, very gradually over time, creating all the variety of life we see before us. Interesting, hmm? <laughs> I don't see the point of your ramblings. Only a mind free of impediments is capable of grasping the chaotic beauty of the world. This is our greatest asset. But is chaos something to be celebrated? Is disorder a virtue? It presents us with challenges, yes, but freedom yields greater rewards than the alternative. The order and peace that the Templars seek requires servility and imprisonment. Hmm, I know the feeling. I knew it was him. I told you. I'll bet the Templars would pay a pretty handsome reward for those two. 